What's going on guys, Nick coming here, aka the Crypto Hitman, and I needed to make a quick video here today. Why is that? That is because of our games. You can see our games just went under a rebranding. They are about to launch their R game token, the world's first AI racing game, powered on Unreal Engine. Looks amazing. They got good follower base, and it is launching very soon, guys. Very soon. Launching April 8th, 10 a.m. UTC at a listing price of 0 0.0075. Will be launching on MEXC, Gate.io, Pancake Swap on the BSC network. We love it. And Jupiter Exchange on the Solana network. Getting some of that hype. Will some of that liquidity from the meme coins look for an opportunity to get in a GameFi coin on Solana? We shall see. So let's go over to the website and see what this is all about. As you can see, the website is beautiful. The graphics of the games are beautiful. It is our games, and their ticker symbol is our game. Like I said, the launch is in 11 hours, 23 minutes, and 50 cents. If you want to keep an eye on this timer, this countdown clock, go to ourgames.tech, and you can learn a little bit about it. Of course, we see some recognizable faces on this back by. They are already seeing some media coverage. Stay tuned to some of my standalone tweets. There is a couple articles I will be posting there as well of things that kind of caught my eye. Welcome to our games, the virtual garage. Showcase your vehicle collection and admire your upgrades. If you're a gamer, you know that racing games continue to be mainstream. Gives me need for speed vibes. Rocket League is huge right now. There are so many racing games that have gone over, come and gone over the years, starting all the way back with the Nintendo NES, PlayStation 1, Nintendo 64, GameCube, Wii, and as we moved on, now people have whole racing setups in their house. So this is a popular sector. There's going to be various modes, street racing, time trials, a story mode, and weaponized vehicles for demolition mode, unique vehicle modeling, so you'll be able to modify all your, your cars. I'm sure if you race more and you win more, you get more in-game currency to upgrade your car. I'm assuming our game comes into play with the gaming mechanics as well. Maybe you can spend our game to get new cars. Maybe you can stake our game to get new cars. I know there will be staking to earn our game based on set APRs and a percentage of revenue that this game does produce. And then, of course, futuristic AI. AI to deploy faster vehicle models, dynamic game behavior, adjusting to user-generated content and demand. You know, AI is hyped right now, but the use of AI can be applied to many sectors, and including the GameFi sector. Because remember, AI can help generate car models, car skins, car weapons, much faster than a general uh, UI UX designer can. So now you get a jump start with, you, with AI to get, hey, look at this new car. Now a UI UX specialist can go in, make small modifications, and implant that in the video game rapidly. Here's all the the uh, modes I was talking about. The a, the alpha version of the game is already out. You can go play the alpha version, okay? So of course you want this to get to mainnet, because with mainnet means everything's gonna be a full go. You're probably gonna see sponsorships on the side of these cars, which drives revenue. You're probably gonna see full Web3 integration of the R game token, which drives utility, utilization, transaction volume for the token as well. Nonetheless, I am excited for a couple of reasons. A you know, great time to launch. Mark is doing well. GameFi is ultimately very hyped right now. But B, I'm going to play this thing. I have no coin of friends that are big gamers. I'm trying to get them into games or maybe they can earn some, some money. Maybe they can learn about cryptocurrency through the video game ecosystem. And this is a great opportunity. A lot of them play Rocket League, which is a car soccer game. Uh, this isn't quite the same, uh, but uh, they like the racing. They like their cars. So it's pretty cool. This looks like a BMW here. Interesting. Genesis, interesting. Okay, you got the roadmap here full of surprises, of course. Roadmaps are general outlines, and then, you know, you need to fill in some things. Coin Market Cap, Coin Gecko, Dex Tools, Dex Screener, Investex, Beyond FOMO, AMA, Spaces. Exciting times in cryptocurrencies because there are so many ways to get exposure for your projects and so many things that these projects need to stay on top of. And with that, that means you need a big core team. I already see eight people here. They got three additional advisors. Now, do any of these people catch your eye? This does right here. Mario Nuffall, one of the largest Twitter spaces in the crypto game. His Twitter spaces garnish anywhere between 40,000 to 120,000 views. And if he is coming out posting about our games on the day of launch, around launch, and supporting them, 
with their brand awareness, with their growth, with their strategic partnerships, then, uh, you know, he knows a lot of people in the space and he's going to be pushing this quite well. Institutional advisors, you do see uh, Adiana Ventures, you see Ferrum Network here, Lavender Capital, Q. U Ventures, powered by the Unreal Engine, Fabwelt, which is a gaming uh, company brand that this team also has on the side, BNB Chain, and Solana. And then you can co come down here and take a look. They do have a Git book coming up. They got governance. They got a marketplace where I'm sure you need to spend our game in order to upgrade your car. Staking for our game holders so you can earn APR while the video game continues to produce revenue, build out user base, and get more utility for the token. Our modes and the virtual garage. I mean, you know, if you want to figure out how to get into some of these projects early, join us at patreon.com slash learn crypto. We get into a lot of projects, a lot of startup projects very early. With all these projects, you need some kind of startup capital. And with that is pre-sales. Uh, in order to get into the pre-sales, you either got to get in the public round via like a launch pad or you can get in through private and seed rounds. Now, you do have to be a little earlier, but you do that via holding Ferrum and uh, supporting Ferrum Network. So check out patreon.com slash learn crypto. We walk you through all these things. So that is your uh, full disclosure that yes, I am in the pre-sale of our game. Yes, I like our games. Yes, I'll be playing our games. And yes, our games launches in 11 hours and 18 minutes on MEXC, on gate.io, Solana Network on Jupiter, Bing X, and on the BSC Network on PancakeSwap. What can we expect? They got Dial Maker. They got Mario Nowfall. They got Ferrum Network. They got two different networks. What are you guys expecting? Remember, launch price is at 0 0.0075. So keep that in mind if you are ever going to buy our games, if you are ever going to hold our games, or if you are ever going to stake our games. That is the starting price at market launch tomorrow. So check it out one last time. Official Twitter account. Don't get bamboozled. Don't click on any links. Make sure you're on the verified account with 111,000 followers. R underscore games official. We'll see what the launch looks like tomorrow. We'll see what the future holds. Maybe you'll see me racing some cars. I'll need some uh, R Games content for the channel. Hmm, that could be interesting. So make sure to stay tuned for your daily updates right here at Learn Crypto.